Hey y'all, the Lone Power Ranger here. I'm gonna try to get this done as soon as possible, but it's most likely gonna be cut off. Um, for today's review, we got Power Rangers Down in Fury, Moza Razor Zord. I'm really excited to get into this. A quick overview of the box. Art, blah blah, art. Ooh, look what it does. And bottom, nothing. Top just says Power Rangers Down in Fury. Um, yeah, let's get right into this. Alright, here's the Moza Razor Zord in the Zord mode. Um, it looks pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Then the hands, they turn into these little things. And they're just like kind of on their own. And then also, here's the key. Let's go over this real quick. So this is the key here. Let me... This is the key here. It's the Zord one, obviously. And if you take off that, you can see... That, then in there, there's the Gold Ranger. Now, I don't have his Morpher, but I have the Morpher. Let's see what happens when I put his key in here. That's what he does in there. Um, to turn this thing from this into the Megazord, let me do this now. You know, first thing you want to do is take off the tail. That will separate the legs. Then you could put this guy up like this. While you're down here, put these up and bring them up. I'm gonna turn the head like that. Do that. Then you're gonna turn these down like this. Then you're gonna flip those open to here. Then you can put his hands in, which are just these little guys here. Then you take your key, put it in on top. It'll, there we go. Then you can, you can use his tail as a sword. Here is the Moza Razor Sword. Um, this thing looks pretty cool. This, I really like how it looks. And now, let me combine it with the T-Rex Zord. Alright, so from your T-Rex Zord, you're honestly not going to need a whole lot. You're going to need his head, his tail, not dropping the camera. It's not staying in there, right? His tail and his two glasses. And how is this going to work? Let me stand him up straight. I can ever get his leg to actually stay on every time I move it. Yeah, anyways, you're gonna take his arms off. Alright, just the whole thing. I'm just trying to get him standing correctly. And then what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna put the blasters on to where the arms go. And then you put the arms back on on top of the blaster. So you have some blasters on his shoulders. If I could just ever get this thing not to fall apart every time I try to move something. And then what you're gonna want Is to put the T Rex head on there like that. I don't know why this thing is not. can't just stand up correctly. Then 
you would put on the tail on like this, like facing inwards. And then his tail is going to be used as a sword on this side. But get him to stand right. This, so far, this is my issue with the Zord. It's it's really hard to get to stay together and move it at the same time. This, this whole thing just fell apart. Alright, I actually forgot how far I got. Because I had to leave to go do something. And now a couple hours have passed. But, yeah, this is the final thing. I think you can pretty much figure out how I, everything happened. I'm going to be completely honest. I do not like this combination. I would not display it like this. First of all, it just looks bad. Second of all, there's so much left over from the T-Rex Zord. We use th four parts from it. These two right here, his head and his tail. And you don't change anything on... Oh, what Zord is this? Hold on, I, I've been... The Mozarese Zord. I'm trying to figure out stuff. They're like school dances. Anyways. um, Yeah. Just not a fan of this combination. Is there any other ones I can do? No. Okay, real quick, I made a little mistake earlier. In Zord mode, you're gonna, you're gonna wanna flip these forward. So he has like little arms. Alright, and that was my review of the Power Rangers Dino Fury Mozo Razor Zord. Um, this is actually a really cool Zord. I really like it. Only problem with it, honestly, is that I wish the legs would stand a little better. Or, like, from the waist down. And it's not the toy's fault, but the combination with the T-Rex Zord is kind of lame. But other than those two things, which are really small things, honestly, this is a really good pickup, and I really recommend it. Um, get it while you can, because it's going to be really expensive watching, like, these next couple of months when these toys are set, are finally getting out of stock, and they're not, gonna, they're not making it anymore. So... Oh, what? I made an intro for the last review, and I have no idea what it was, because that was like weeks ago when I actually filmed it. Um, may the power protect you.